Welcome to Simple Review, the series where I briefly play a game, review it, and keep it simple. If at any point you find this review to be helpful, consider leaving a like and subscribing. Now in this review, I'm covering the multiplayer experience of Super Monkey Ball Banana Mania. When playing this game, you will have two single player modes and one multiplayer mode. The single player modes are Main Game and Ranking Challenge. Main Game consists of Story Mode, Challenge Mode for Remastered Super Monkey Ball 1 levels, Challenge Mode for Remastered Super Monkey Ball 2 levels, Trading Modes, and additional Special Modes unlocked from normal gameplay. Story Mode consists of 10 zones, each with 10 levels. Comic book style cutscenes explain the story when playing this mode. Between all modes, you will have over 300 levels to complete from Super Monkey Ball, Super Monkey Ball 2, and Super Monkey Ball Deluxe. Even though main game is single player, I find taking turns with friends locally in this mode to be very enjoyable. Challenge mode will allow you to complete any zone or multiplayer level to place your time on an online leaderboard. The multiplayer mode is called Party Games. This mode supports 4 player local play on 12 classic party games. Playing any of these modes, whether it's single player or multiplayer, will earn you a currency to purchase many items from the point shop. This could be new characters, cosmetic items, new modes, and so on. Now when it comes to gameplay, you will begin by choosing a character that is then placed on a board. Your goal is to reach a goal placed on this board. There's collectibles scattered around this board if you want to collect them, but it's not required to win. In order to move around, you will be tilting this board causing your character to roll around in a ball. Upon reaching the goal, you will win. And that's all that this game has to offer. Now for my experience, I'd have to say I'm very happy with this game. Performance wise, I had a solid 60 FPS in both single player and local multiplayer. The amount of levels is very impressive. Multiplayer modes are all really fun and provide an in-depth separate experience from the typical monkey ball experience. Being able to earn currency, no matter the mode that you play, makes playing multiplayer feel rewarding. Single player, although designed to be played by one person, is highly enjoyable when taking turns locally. Being able to compete against friends online in a leaderboard adds replayability. It would have been nice to have real co-op in the main game, but the multiplayer modes are very fun and well designed. Overall, I'd have to give the multiplayer experience 8 pepperonis out of 10, and the full experience 10 pepperonis out of 10. Super Monkey Ball Banana Mania is an excellent party game that most fans of this series will find enjoyable. And that'll do it for this review. Comment below if you have any questions, and I will try to help.